Who want a ticket straight to them pearly gates? Here we go. One final time. The media tour I've been hyping up as well as the developers on Twitter is seeming like it's coming to an end. It's synchronizing perfectly with the start of the Game Awards. I showed you guys the string of tweets so here it is one more time. Starting off in Korea, Harada says here we go. He also has this tweet here about Virtual Fighter 2. What is that about? Who knows? Ikeda is also there and this is when we get a little bit more information. Next tour is Europe and the United States. The next post from Harada, they're in London. We see a picture, we see game setups, we see the local media that they're actually talking to. As they're going from place to place, nothing from the media is published. It seems like they're waiting from the specific go ahead from Bandai Namco to reveal whatever it is they are talking about in these media tours. Today, Ikeda posted on the beach taking a picture in Los Angeles, California. Yasuda is also there. We know Michael Murray is there as well and also Harada. They finally touched down in USA. How many different locations they will go around to? Maybe not that much because if you think about it, I think the Game Awards take place in LA. So it wouldn't make sense for them to go to LA, leave LA, go to let's say New York or something like that and then come back to LA. So this is probably their final destination, their final roundup. They're gonna be talking to the media here. And then I'm, I'm assuming when Game Awards start, they will either announce something on stage or, and this is what I was thinking about, maybe they will do an announcement after. Jeff Keighley, he has this trailer where he's basically promoting the Game Awards. It says Thursday, Game Awards streams alive to celebrate the best and reveal what's next for video games. In this trailer, you guys will see it in the background. It basically just give you a sneak peek of of not everything, but just a decent amount of stuff that's gonna be there. Last time they did this at GamesCon, Tekken 8 was featured. Leroy Smith said, you're ready or you're done or something like that, right? This time around, I watched this trailer three times and I did not see any hint of Tekken 8 at all. Now that doesn't mean that Tekken 8 won't be here. They try to hype up the reveal as much as possible. So they could just be holding out, but as it stands, there's no real confirmation Tekken 8 will be here. Okay, time out. Right as I was about to start editing this video, I just checked Twitter again just to see what was going on. You know, there was some stuff about Street Fighter, Mortal Kombat. I was like, what else could be happening? Oh my God. Okay, let me not hype this up. Let me not hype this up. But it's big. Do you know how Twitter shows you when someone responds to a tweet that you previously seen? That happened. The Game Awards responded to Harada saying arrived in Los Angeles, all they said was welcome. Now I know there's going to be down players in the comment section who's like, ah, oh, that doesn't mean anything. Oh, that doesn't, eh, eh, eh. The Game Awards responded and said welcome. If you ask me, this is a hundred percent confirmation that Tekken 8 is going to show something fantastic on stage. I was starting to lose hope. I was starting to lose faith. I was like, man, it wasn't a part of the trailer. That kind of sucks. But no, bro. The end, I told you guys. The media tour. Bro, I told you guys. All right. Time in. I just want to add this section into the video. Let's continue as normal. Time in. We do know that they're cooking up something with the media tour. And maybe what they could do is like what they did at Summer Games Fest. Where the whole entire... um. Game Awards presentation happens and then a couple hours after Tekken 8 reveals whatever they reveal because if you think about Claudio and the beta that's exactly what happened we watched the whole entire two hour event no Tekken 8 we panicked for like two hours and then boom beta announcement so is that what they're going to do this time around only time will tell but the media tour is a big clue that something's going on they're at their final destination they're in USA, Los Angeles, and it's only a matter of time before something is published by Bandai Namco. Once it does, you guys know I'll be the first to talk about it. So subscribe to the channel, leave a like on this video, but that's it. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.